going back to what we were talking about before he called Gino. Yeah. I like that call, bro. That's not bad. 20, 20%, like it, 30% snaps max. The reason why I like it is this, man. Um, in terms of sub package ball, he gives you pass rush. That is what he definitely can do. He is a get off the ball type of guy, man. Three, you know, three technique. He's shooting B gaps. That's that's what he specializes in. In a condensed role, like he would be if he were to come here. Tyson's basically. Absolutely. That's perfect. Now, the difference I would uh that I would want to see just in terms of base personnel, Tyson, we play more as a nose, whereas with Gino, because it was more of a four three set, he was usually out there in that B gap. But you I feel like you can you can make it work with a guy like Gino. But I just don't like Gino. I don't see him going back to playing like nose, which is what oh, Tyson we do played. Bugs then? We, we, we I would just go stick Bugs for base, Bugs Davis for base, and then when we go sub package, I'd rather have Gino out there instead of Wormley, Laudermilk, Bugs Davis, you know, because I just think he rushes the passer way better than those guys. Picking up division rivals left and right. Yeah. Joe Schobert, then Adkins. Hey, man. <laughs> hey, it don't matter how we do it. We just got to find a way to do it, man. Yeah, I'm definitely yeah. open for that. I was hoping. Like I mentioned with the Taco Charlton move, I was yeah. hoping we'd try to find a, an inside guy like Atkins. Mm-hmm. But, yeah, I guess we're going edge. I don't know if they didn't like what they saw in Jameer Jones. They wanted to make this move quick, or we yeah. just wanted depth. We don't know how long TJ Watt's going to be out. But hopefully they address, address the inside yeah. because I'm guessing TJ Watt's only going to be out for max like two or three weeks. That's what, that's what Whereas I Whereas the Alawalu, yeah. he might be out the whole season. I think Tyson will be out for the whole season. Like, that's... That's significant coming back from that. Hayden, right he should yeah. be back, hopefully. Bush, like those guys, Correct. short-term injuries to it, he should be coming back on mm-hmm. IR, hopefully. The main one is the inside, the nose tackle, yeah. defensive tackle. So Geno Atkins is a really good idea, yeah. in my opinion. I like Geno. He'll be low risk, too, in terms of the cost. Not going to cost him a lot. Very familiar with him because he was a division foe. And he'll be motivated. Come on now. It's nothing. You talk about being motivated, man. You get on a team where you know, okay, we're good enough. And maybe I can be an additional piece to that. It motivates you. You do want to work a little bit more with that, man. So maybe this thing, you know, keep, keep your eyes open. That's not a bad idea. Man. We've been making crazy moves off season, yeah, beginning of the bro. season. <laughs> we're just keeping So I'm going. not putting anything past yeah. Colbert and just we're the front office. Because Charlton's out of left field right now. 